I just someone who's really excited to try new hairstyles every day rather than the same old ponytail and a braid, then this video is for you. And I'm here today to decode all those things that you need in your kit so that you can get the best, beautiful, easy, effortless hairstyles for every single day. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, hi, my name is Vinisha. Thank you so much for tuning in and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already because it's free and you get notified whenever I upload a new video. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button as well as the bell icon so that you will get notified whenever I upload a new video. Now without any further delay, let's start the video. Now this video will have all the things that you will need if you are doing your hairstyle all by yourself and if you don't have anyone to help you around. So so it's perfectly fine you will do all the things by yourself and some basic tools will actually help you so much that you can do everything without any help needed now the first important thing that i feel you need in your kit is having section clips like this so these are like really long clips and you can get whatever brand you like but make sure that you get good quality ones so that you don't have to buy them very often so it comes in a pack of 12 or 10 usually and one pack is more than enough for you so if i could find all these products online then i'll definitely leave the link below so these clips help in you know sectioning your hair so that if you want to do a hairstyle where you don't want this part of your hair to mix with the other one you either need someone to hold it for you or you can easily clip it like this if you don't have help and then start doing the rest so that this part doesn't disturb you so that way it's easier for you to do your hairstyles by yourself so you find me using a lot of these clips in my hairstyle videos right because this is so so important especially if you don't have help to you know hold a piece of hair and you're just the one doing hairstyle all by yourself so this is very very handy so yeah please do try to you know get one of these so that it's so easy and you are going to thank me later now next most important things that you should be having in your kit is a rubber bands so now you get variety of rubber bands right the one which is like really um like the normal uh, matte rubber bands which is like really uh, thick and rubbery and then you get this kind of you know shiny rubber bands which is also called as disco rubber bands so you get these two so ideally getting a black rubber band which is matte and finish is so much better than using a disco rubber band like this because these shiny rubber bands tend to you know reflect light when you actually wear them and uh, a matte rubber band doesn't show off that easily so it's better you invest in a black matte rubber band rather than you know getting disco rubber bands like this also if you have a bleached hair or if you have like blonde highlights blonde hair or any of those stuff then i would prefer that you use a clear rubber band like this so if you have like really light hair on the top then using a clear rubber band will actually camouflage it and you hardly notice a rubber band on your hair also these rubber bands are only for you know those days where you want to do a special hairstyle i don't personally prefer using this for every day so for everyday use please invest in something like a satin uh, band or something which is really soft on the hair so that it doesn't pull all your uh, hair every time you take the band off especially while sleeping and everything i would always prefer that you use a uh, satin or silk band rather than using rubber bands like this so these are only on the days for you know special hairstyles which you really want to do like easy effortless hairstyle which you are going to wear for some time and not like throughout the day or anything like that the next most important things are u pins which i haven't used much on my channel yet but very soon you will see a lot of hairstyles where i use u pins especially buns and u pins are very very important so get the ones which has that ball on the tip so that it's easier and doesn't hurt your scalp so i'll leave all the ones which i can find in the description below so that you can go check it out so there are hair pins there are bobby pins right so if you see right now these are also called as uh, hair pins but the tip is like really sharp also in this one if you see you have like two balls on the end so that it does not hurt your scalp also the quality of these two are so much different like this one if i had to use like um four of these one to get a secure a uh, pin of my hair then i would probably need only two for this one so that is how much hold a good quality bobby pin can give you so quality of bobby pins is really really important in you know 
uh, your hairstyles don't invest in cheap ones they are not that great in holding your hair always invest in good quality bobby pins and that way your hairstyle is very secure and also the number of pins you use on your hair is so much lesser and you also get that hold properly throughout the day next most important thing that you keep asking me is comb so most of my videos you might have seen this comb which is my tail comb so this one has a tail which is made of metal and there is also another uh, product in the market which has the same plastic tail and i find both are like equally you know great and sometimes for bridals i prefer using the plastic uh, one because it's so much easier because sometimes you know when your hands are sweating or anything you might feel like you know this is a bit slippery so why i like using this is just to take partisan for example if you want to divide your hair you just have to put it in like this and then divide your hair and then if you want like volume on one side you can use this tail to just lift your hair like this and you know create some volume on your hair so that is like the main purpose why you need a tail comb so that while doing hairstyles it's so much easier for you and it also you know acts as a tool to help you give volume and everything in the front so yeah invest in a good quality tail comb and you will definitely find you know it's like the best investment you've made ever or uh, there are also different varieties of uh, combs which you can use like uh, to you know detangle your hair like the tangle teaser and all that but i'm not going into that part because that really comes under hair care and i wanted to show you guys only products that are you know best suited for hairstyles especially of or all the hairstyles in my channel now the next product which i want to show you guys is not very important and you have to get i try to avoid it mostly for my everyday hairstyles but if you want to use it on some occasion where you find you know it's a party or an event wedding whatever it is and you want that extra effort to be done invest in a good hairspray so the one which i have right now is the l'oreal elnet hairspray so i have the small one so i prefer using this to control the frizz and everything on the front and you know even those baby hair which is there on top i just use this to control it sometimes when it's like really um you know odd and spoiling my hairstyle that's the only time i prefer using this but mostly i try to avoid this for everyday hairstyles so this is something which you can keep in your kit and use it only if it's necessary you don't have to use it every single time like for everyday hairstyles i would definitely say don't use it if you're used to putting hairstyles for work college school and all don't use a hairspray every single day but special events on a party or occasion birthday or whatever it is that day you can definitely go and you know do all those extra things now next on my list is something just again optional if you want to accentuate your hairstyles to next level then make sure that you invest in a few hair decorative stuffs like these so these are like different clips these golden catchers hair bands again like beautiful pearl clips and everything so these will definitely accentuate your hairstyles to the next level so rather than having a simple plain uh, hairstyle on a plain hair having like one or two decor items is going to take it to the next level and give you that you know so much effort done kind of look so you can flaunt your hairstyles to another level again it's completely optional and you can buy them only if you really want to so i got most of them from shein because it's kind of cheap and i found a lot of varieties here but i know shein is not available in india and most of similar kind of these you get it in amazon and other similar apps like i can find a few and link it below if you want me to now the most important thing that i have today is this product which i'm going to be talking now and that is investing in a very very good hair straightener so why i say hair hair straightener is very important is that you need to prep your hair before getting those really effortless beautiful hair on which you can do beautiful hairstyles so the canvas is like really important for you to work on it so that you get the best looking hairstyles so So for that, I always always suggest using a hair straightener to curl your hair. So you are not going to be straightening your hair; you are going to be curling your hair so that it looks voluminous and beautiful. So that way, you get to have a look which is more like sleek and beautiful on the top, without the frizz flying off here and there. And also in the bottom, you have beautiful curls so that it looks voluminous and really good. I have a video where I have talked about. 
different hair straighteners you can go check it out i will link on the top and please do consider getting a good quality hair straightener because there are so many in the market like personally i feel if you buy a straightener and you need to curl your hair make sure that you buy one where you have rounded edges here rather than the flat plates so you get two types of straighteners one you have the flat plate and the other one you have these rounded plates so with these rounded ones you get beautiful curls rather than the one which has like the flat plate so always make sure that you get the one which has that rounded plates so you can curl your hair and it looks really flattering and beautiful now another bonus tip that i would want to share is if you like doing a lot of hairstyles like very simple basic hairstyles but you want your hair to look like you know on the next level try coloring your hair like coloring i mean like you know either doing a balayage or like highlighting where you have like little bits and pieces where the lines are visible so if you have colored your hair even a normal basic hairstyle will look so much better on your hair compared to a head full of hair where it's like one plain color so if you have like different shades of color going on the hairstyle will definitely definitely look so much better and beautiful and coloring i mean not like you know trying on bold different colors even like a one or two uh, shades lighter than your hair color will actually make your hair look so much so much better so yeah that is like one bonus tip which i have learned over the years and hope it helps for you as well so that's it those are all the tips which i really wanted to share with you guys please do let me know in the comments below if you find this video useful and what you would like to see if i had to make a part 2 of this video please don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already also follow me on instagram i'm more active and engaging with my audience in instagram please do follow me there and i'll see you guys very very soon in another video thanks for watching bye bye take care